welcome to vj chemistry today we are going to discuss about the main group element lecture 11 in lecture 11 we are going to discuss the oxide of phosphorus and hydrolysis please students this is very most important topic please know this most important topic of a jam exam point of view okay the question was already here based on this concept first i give you the basic introduction about what is the oxide of phosphorus please note the phosphorus oxide the phosphorus oxide is exist as is exist is exist in dimeric form of very important a dimer form of adamantan system the form of forming adamantan system adamantan like structure very important adamantan like structure what is adamantan like structure please know this adamantan system okay the chair form cyclic chair form see this is one adamantan system okay this is what this is called adamantan a d m a n t a n a adamantan now in this what is number of ring the number of a ring that is equal to what three three ring right a number of chair form find the number of chair form the number of the chair form the number of what number of chair form it should be answer is how much answer is four understand next point very important in oxide of phosphorus each phosphorus each phosphorus is very important sp3 hybridization very important point please note sp3 hybridization okay now what is the important point first point the ox oxide of phosphorus always is this one dimeric form right now see for example if i take monomer if i take monomer monomer I take P2O3, this is a monomer. What is dimeric form of this one? What is dimeric form? P2O6, right? P2O6. O6. Similarly, this is P2O5, this is monomer. What is dimeric form? This is P2O10. Very important. The examples, okay? Now, I'm going to give very, very important point. The base on structure of the structure of what? Oxide of phosphorus. Please note. Very important point. Now you know very well, right? The basic unit of silicate. What is the basic unit of silicate? Si, SiO4, 4 minus. Similarly, what is the basic unit of oxide of phosphorus? Please note. The basic unit of the basic unit of unit of oxide of phosphorus. Phosphorus oxide is oxide is what is the basic unit? The P4O6 is a basic unit for what? All oxide of phosphorus. Understand very, very please note. The, Put the box on this very important what is the basic unit the p4o6 for what basic unit for all the oxide of phosphorus okay now i'm going to explain what the five structure five important important oxide of phosphorus one by one okay now, st now start the discussion please know structure of structure of please know very important structure okay structure of phosphorus oxide very important okay very very important for our jam exam point of view See, first I give a second. What is the basic unit? P4, O6. Please know this is P4, O6. It's a basic unit. You know, see, simple. Adamantan like so, phosphorus, here oxygen, here phosphorus, here oxygen, here phosphorus. Then this is chart form, right? Then what? Make this like phosphorus. Then this also phosphorus. This is oxygen. Okay. This is what one, two, three, four, P4. Oh, this is what base. This is a basic unit. Basic unit for what? Unit of the oxide of phosphorus. Now, is the first one. Okay. What is second one? P4O7. What is such a very simple? P4O7. Okay. Now, see, in case of four phosphorus, the right. In case of increasing one oxygen, now you have to what? Make one double bond between the phosphorus and oxygen bond. Okay. This P4O7. Seven. What is such a very simple? First, first make a basic unit, phosphorus and oxygen. Then the phosphorus, then oxygen. This is phosphorus, then the oxygen. This is a basic unit, right? Then this is oxygen. Here phosphorus, here oxygen, here oxygen. It's a basic unit. Is this one, two, three, uh, four, four phosphorus and six oxygen? One more oxygen. That, that right? What will happen? We go to what? We going to put one form or one P double bond O one. I make this like. P double bond. This is structure of what? P four O seven. Now you're going to write P four O eight, right? What is P four O eight? To make P double bond O two bond. Okay, two 
2p p o bond here p4 o eight simple here phosphorus here oxygen here phosphorus here oxygen then here phosphorus here oxygen simple right now in this case here oxygen here phosphorus here oxygen now in this case, this is oxygen and the phosphorus simple here oxygen okay now make what two p double bond o p double bond o and i make p double this is for structure of p4 o8 okay i go in this right i will explain two more p4 o9 and p4 o10 okay very important structure and fourth one that is p4 o9 same make first atom and atom system okay p4 o6 here phosphorus here oxygen here phosphorus here oxygen here phosphorus make oxygen simple then here oxygen here phosphorus then the oxygen this is what the p4 o6 structure the how many p4 o6 remaining how many oxygen three oxygen will be there right that why i make what three p double bond o and one p double bond o and next p double bond o and this is p double this is what structure of p4 o9 and final one what is structure p4 o10 very important this is p4 o Ten oxygen ten. First make what same P four O six make a basic unit. Then what equal at the P double bond O bond. Okay. Now create the basic unit. Here phosphorus, here oxygen, here phosphorus, here oxygen, here phosphorus. Now this is basic right. This is basic unit. Here phosphorus, oxygen, here phosphorus, here oxygen, here phosphorus, here oxygen. Okay. Listen. Phosphorus already of phosphorus, oxygen, phosphorus. I mean okay. Phosphorus, oxygen, phosphorus, oxygen, phosphorus, phosphorus. Already work. Okay. Now make what? How many? This P four O six. Remaining how many oxygen? Four oxygen. Right. Now make what? Four P double bond O bond. Therefore, this is one. This is two. This is three. This is four. Now understand. This is what structure of the oxide of phosphorus. Next, very important. Based on such a we can find out what? What is hydrolysis part? Okay. Now, 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 now what is the question? Now, now P four O ten under go hydrolysis. What is the part? We have to find out using structure only. We can find out very easily. Okay. I'm going to discuss hydrolysis using the structure of the Phosphorus oxide. Okay, now see, in case of phosphorus, we have to find the oxidation state. Now this phosphorus attaches with one oxygen, two, one oxygen, and two and three. Right. Therefore, what? Which is more electron activity? Oxygen. Therefore, this is plus three. Right. Ah, uh? one, one, one. Therefore, four oxygen. In this four oxygen, four phosphorus. What about other oxygen? Plus three oxygen state. Right. But in this case, what? This oxygen plus three. But this oxygen, here electron pool, electron pool, electron. This two electron. Right. Therefore, this plus five. Up in case of Four, four phosphorus. In case of four phosphorus, what will happen? Four phosphorus. The three phosphorus, it should be plus three state, and one phosphorus, it should be what? One phosphorus, it should be plus five state. But in this case, this is plus five. This is plus five. Remaining two phosphorus plus three and plus three and plus three. Among four phosphorus, right? The two phosphorus, it should be plus three, and the two phosphorus, it should be plus five. Now find out this one very simple, right? Now this phosphorus plus three, other three phosphorus plus five. This is also plus five. This also plus five, and this also plus five, right? Therefore, among the four phosphorus, okay, and three one phosphorus, it should be what plus three, and other three phosphorus, it should be what plus five. In this case, all the phosphorus, okay, all the four phosphorus, it should be what the plus five oxidation state. Now very simple trick, listen. If I, if I, if 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 undergo listen if I, if the oxide of phosphorus undergo hydrolysis na no, I get what is a note I give this by note here note okay the phosphorus oxide undergo hydrolysis H two I get what oxy acid of phosphorus I get oxy acid of phosphorus very simple okay in case of plus three if I do hydrolysis I take what I I I give I I I do the hydrolysis I get what The plus three containing oxygen acid, which is plus three oxygen acid phosphorus. I take the four moles of H three PO three. This is plus three, right? If I do hydrolysis now, what will happen? The three phosphorus plus three, one phosphorus plus five. Right? Therefore, I get what the plus three containing oxygen acid and plus five containing oxygen, acid, which is plus three containing oxygen acid H three PO. Therefore, I take three moles of H three PO three plus I get what one moles of H three PO four because This phosphorus it should be plus five, and this phosphorus it will be plus three. Similar this, okay? Do hydrolysis. How many plus three phosphorus there? Two phosphorus. Therefore, I get what? So two moles of H three PO three 
At the same time, how many plus five? Plus plus two, right? I get what? Two moles of S three PO four because this is plus five. This is what? This is plus three. Similar way. Try to try to tell the answer for this one. We do hydrolysis. I get what? I get one mole of plus three containing oxygen instead of S three PO three plus what? I can plus five. That is S three PO four. That is three moles. Very important. Mole is very important. But in this case, a P four O ten all plus 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 five, right? We do hydrolysis. I get the answer. What? I get the four moles of S three PO four. Okay. Very very important. Listen. Maximum the two question as based on two question will be based on this this concept. What is the question now? What is structure of P four O nine? Okay. How many P O P one will be there? They ask the question. Then how many P? Listen. Number of questions, please. Not the questions. First question they ask the number of the number of P O P one. Okay. Number of P O P one. And second question they ask what the number of the number of P double bond O one. They ask this question. Okay. Now what is the third question? They ask what they ask what is the hydrolysis product? Hydrolysis product. Okay. These three questions maximum can ask based on what the oxide of phosphorus. Okay. This is very simple topic as well as all the very important topic for our jam exam point of view. I hope you understand this concept and thank you so much for watching and see you in the studio and as soon as possible and tata bye bye.